We have a little bit of a problem. AI is kind of taking over everything and I don't know what else to do besides make these videos. Want to know how I made this? We'll follow along to find out. And stay tuned to the end of the video for an animated short using this process. Runway ML's Gen 3 Alpha just came out with Act 1. Act 1 allows you to bring a character to life by uploading a driving performance to precisely influence expressions, mouth movements, and more. Okay, so let me show you how to create characters like this in just a few easy clicks. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to Firefly and I'm gonna actually try to create my character. So I have my prompt here. I'm just gonna click generate. First generation, I'm not gonna do anything with. And I'm gonna change the aspect ratio to 16 by nine. And I'm gonna make my content type auto. Under composition reference, I'm actually going to upload, not the most flattering screenshot, but that's okay. Strength on my composition reference, I'm actually gonna bring all the way down. And under styles, I'm gonna upload a example. So now I'm gonna click generate. And after quite a few generations, and as you can see, if it gets closer to the prompt that you want, you can click on edit and click on generate similar. And after quite a few prompt adjustments, here's what it came up with. Okay, so now that I have my character set, I'll make sure that I have my video clip of me or my actor doing a driving performance with expressions, mouth movements, etc. So here's me embarrassing myself. And next we're in Runway ML, and I'm just gonna go to the Act 1, try it now. And here it's gonna take you to this. It's gonna give you the info here and some other examples you could use down here, some pre-made characters. I'm gonna click on Select Asset, upload my clip here. Runway actually gives you some really good insight in this document on how to generate the best result. I'll drop that link below. So I have my video clip here. I try to over exaggerate my facial animations a little bit. And here I'm just gonna click on upload and I'm gonna upload my character that I showed you guys before. Now based on your aspect ratio, it might ask you to crop. So I'm just gonna click on crop. It's gonna say detecting a human face. If it goes to the screen, that means it detected a human face. If you're using another sort of like a monster or like an animal and it might not be able to detect it, you might get this message. So I suggest you either tweak your character or you start from scratch and create something new. So from here, I'm just gonna click on generate. Here's the result. We have a little bit of a problem. AI is kind of taking over everything and I don't know what else to do besides make these videos. Now here's a short I created using the same process and some other AI tools. All right, guys, welcome to the DIY on YouTube. I'm gonna show you how to fix this toilet. Let's do it. I don't think it's supposed to do that. Uh-oh. Okay, seems as if we got a little bit of a leak, but stay tuned. Like and subscribe.